Welcome to another edition of the Color Pigeons and More TV show. The show that covers all aspects of the pigeon hobby, whether it be racing, performing rollers, flying tipplers, fancy show pigeon, and more. Interviews with well-known pigeon breeders, breed profiles, loft construction and management, pigeon health and treatment, show coverage, genetics, just to name a few. Watch, learn, and enjoy. And now let's go to our host, Danny Joe Humphrey, and see what this show is going to be about. I'm Danny Joe Humphrey, and the day kicks off our third show. It's November. Promise to give you one the first of each month. Got a good one for you today. Really do. I just got from got back from the National Young Bird Show in Louisville, Kentucky. Got a bunch of pictures and video of some birds that you probably never would see uh, any place but at a big show like that. Maybe it'll encourage you to go next time. But I got to take one care of one order of business. Uh, I said something in the last show about naming a bird. Well, I. I got him back now. I'm about sure that, that it's a male white frill back. And what we what we were gonna do was have a name that name that bird thing. I've been trying to tame him, but this little rascal is feisty. He really is. I think I think it's a hen. Best I can tell so far, I think it's a hen. But this is her. And we got a bunch of names. I was very pleased with the amount of names that people sent in. I got a list of them here. I'll read some to you. One is called White Knight, uh, Mighty White, Headwig, Puff, Billow, like a white cloud, Curly Joe. That's kind of personalized for me. And then a, a Cajun name of Fleur de Lis, which means flower of the lily, a white flower of the lily. And after looking them over and everything, if it's a female, we're going to call her Fleur de Lis. Fleur de Lis. White Lily. She's a beauty. I'll keep you up with her progress, and maybe a little later we'll find out that maybe she's not a girl after all. She might be a boy. Anyway, I really appreciate the response y'all gave us on this. It, 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 it's good. It's good to know you're watching it and uh, get a lot of positive com uh, comments and and, I, and that means a lot to me because I'm doing this just just because I really I really enjoy doing it and you know with the pigeons and everything else it's, it's just a way of life with me and a lot of you the same way today what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kick the show off and I'm gonna show you some uh, footage from the National Young Bird Show I just got back from and let you see some of the birds, show you a little bit what it looks like in the, in the show hall, even got some video of the sale section where people have their birds for sale. Then after we do that, we're going to come back and we're going to talk to James Turner, the roller guru from uh, Greenwood, South Carolina. I went down to James's place about a month ago, got some really good video. He showed me the ins and outs of all his rollers, and I know you'll be interested in that. He's got some very interesting colors. In fact, he's going to be doing, we're doing a series of genetic tips, trying to tell people how to understand genetics. Uh, it's like a foreign language uh, until you know how to know what it is. So far, I'm still treating it as a foreign language. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to come right back right after this, and we're going to show you some footage of the Louisville Youngbird Show. So stay with us. Hi, this is Jerry Gagne, Foy's Pigeon Supplies, oldest pigeon supply company in the United States. When Danny Joe approached us about being a part of this great project, we were really excited. If you're looking for pigeon supplies, if you're looking for pigeons, I hope you'll give us a call. Foy's Pigeon Supplies, we're on the internet, just type in Foy's. Or if you'd like to call us, it's 1-877-355-7727. Ask about our 204-page all-color catalog. We'd be glad to send it to you. Color Pigeon Loss, featuring 28 breeds of fancy pigeons, high-performance Turner Rollers. We have birds available at all times. Capuchins, Saxon Monks, Saxon Priests, Swiss Crescents, Ice Pigeon, Saints, Frillbacks, Archangels, Starling, Figuritas, Old German Owls, Chinese Owls, Satinets, Swallows, Saxon Shields, and much, much more. For breed availability, visit www.colorpigeons.com. For purchasing, pricing, and shipping info, call toll-free 1-800-527-0918. Murin Nagel, better known as Dr. Pigeon by his friends, is known by his one-eye cold treatment. 
It's called one drop, one time. It only takes one drop, it only takes one time. Every breeder needs at least one bottle of one drop, one time to keep in their loft for those nasty eye colds. They're available at Boys Pet Supply, New England Pigeon Supply, and Pro Flight Supply. And remember, the next time you buy pigeon supplies, be sure to include one bottle of one drop, one time. Okay, here's a Norwich cropper. They're beautiful birds. People have uh, love for powders. I've never been a great powder lover. These are Bruners. They come in some beautiful colors. That's because the people put the colors in. That's even a black white bar there. Here's a bird, I didn't know what this was. So we call it a mystery, mystery powder. It's a Pomeranian powder. See him strutting around doing his business. Here's a beautiful breed. This is an English trumpeter. Very, very popular breed for show. A uh, lot of interest. It's unbelievable how many birds are entered in this particular breed category. Their muscle, big as your hand. You gotta get to one of these shows, I'm telling you, you're missing out. You see so much, so many things and so many breeds that you would never see um, almost anywhere, you know, different parts of the country specialize in different breeds. This, this particular breed is popular all over the country. Here's an archangel, it's a gold black wing. This was a, they call this a lemon, it's obviously a dilute archangel. It's a gold cell. Here's someone uh, judging uh, show racers. It's like a homer, except this bird is bigger. Very neat. They're also good flyers. They're not strictly for show. They're, they're good flyers also. You can tell that they're just strong birds. Here's a picture of the sales section. This is where people, they come in and they pay a fee and they get these little coops so they can put their birds in. You'll see it in a minute. And then they sell them. And then you can walk around and look in them. And See a breed you like, a bird you like, all you gotta do is find out who it is. Some of them put their phone number on there, and some of them are sitting there, so you have to find them. This is Medina's in here. English long face tumblers. I tried to buy them, but they got away from me. This is some clean leg English long face. German Beauty Homer. Some of these got mixed breeds in them. Here's the Glacian High Flyer. Got a head kind of like a woodpecker would have. Some Budapest Tumblers. Unique little bird. Kind of ugly if you look at him and he's kind of cute. It's a group of pygmy powders. They're a lot like the Bruners that they have little feathers on their feet. Supposed to be one of the tamer pigeon breeds that pygmies on. This is a, a mixed cage. This is some Polish lynx, Oriental rollers. Giant homers. West of England tumblers. cage here. Nice pair of black white bar Silesian swallows but they were sold. New York Flying Blights. I think this is the same group of short faced tumblers I've already showed you. I apologize for that. Some diamond doves. They have a dove show there too. Look at the different colors they got. 
Here's a pair of exotic doves, and I'm not about to tell you what they are because I don't have a clue. Ring neck doves. Here's some English trumpeters that are actually being showed. Hannah powder. Bukhara trumpeter. Beautiful bird. Giant runt. These big birds really need something in there you can compare their size to. It's kind of misleading just to see them in a cage. Here's a satinette, a lace satinette. I've got some of these. I really like this breed. That's a silverette, which is still in the Oriental Frill family. It's just uh, got white bars. And here's a, a black lace satinette, a blondinette. And I think these are the moderns with, with a terribly short beak. You have to have foster parents for them. That's a beautiful blondinette there. The blondinettes are laced all over their body. That's what's unique about them. Beautiful satin net there. Another beautiful bird. You got a recessive red, white shield frill back. Here's a black frill back. These little whores. They're also a big bird. It's Argent Medina. Another one. Gazi Medina, American Fantail, Gazi Medina, another American Fantail. This is the show hall. The cages are set up by breed. Jackman is a nice one. It's a Russian tumbler. First time this bird really caught my eye, but it's a pretty, uh, very attractive bird, as you can see. It's got a good following, too. There's a lot of breeders. It's a Silesian swallow, fairy swallow. It's a Hungarian. Color Pigeon Loss, featuring 28 breeds of fancy pigeons, high-performance Turner Rollers. We have birds available at all times. Capuchins, Saxon Monks, Saxon Priests, Swiss Crescents, Ice Pigeon, Saints, Frillbacks, Archangels, Starling, Figuritas, Old German Owls, Chinese Owls, Satinets, Swallows, Saxon Shields, and much, much more. For breed availability, visit www.colorpigeons.com. For purchasing, pricing, and shipping info, call toll-free 1-800-527-0918. Murin Nagel, better known as Dr. Pigeon by his friends, is known by his one-eye cold treatment. It's called One Drop, One Time. It only takes one drop, it only takes one time. Every breeder needs at least one bottle of One Drop, One Time to keep in their loft for those nasty eye colds. They're available at Boys Pet Supply, New England Pigeon Supply, and Pro Flight Supply. And remember, the next time you buy pigeon supplies, be sure to include one bottle of one drop, one time. Hi, this is Jerry Gagne, Foy's Pigeon Supplies, oldest pigeon supply company in the United States. When Danny Joe approached us about being a part of this great project, we were really excited. If you're looking for pigeon supplies, if you're looking for pigeons, I hope you'll give us a call. Foy's Pigeon Supplies, we're on the internet, just type in Foy's. Or if you'd like to call us, it's 1-877-355-7727. Ask about our 204-page all-color catalog. We'd be glad to send it to you.